Hi, my name is Pedro and I work at Advanced Test Equipment. Here I have with me is a 1777 power quality analyzer. This power analyzer has three phase measurements for voltage inputs. Right here you have your first phase, second phase, third phase, and neutral. You also have your four current measurement inputs for iFlex probes. Right here you have your first, second, third phase, and neutral. This unit is currently connected to the input power of this power supply. You have your neutral, third phase, second phase, and first phase. We also have right here our current probes that are wrapped around our input uh, power cables uh, to read current. This power quality analyzer is capable of reading up to a thousand volts in DC AC. As you can see, for each, we have three phases right here. We have 281 volts in each phase, and we are also reading one amp in each phase at 60 hertz. In verify phaser, we can see our phase angle. As you can see, all of our phases are currently being displayed, both in volts and in current. Here we can verify our signal to verify that our signal is good in each phase. Phase A is written, is colored in black, phase B, red, and phase C is blue. Here you can, you can uh, edit the type of degree, whether if it's uh, three phase Y, three phase Y IT, three phase Delta, you have a lot of options here. Here's your nominal voltage. We have it currently set at 480. You can choose to customize it. And lastly, we have our nominal frequency. You can choose between 60 hertz and 50 hertz. To start your reading, you're gonna hit start. and it would begin to log each reading and to see your results and go down to memory go down to logging in sessions here we have our recorded values we're going to hit view and we are able to see our readings Now to edit the duration of your testing, you want to go to PK, PQ Logger. Then you want to go down to Session Settings. Next, you want to hit the Duration Start Time. Here you can choose between 10 minutes, 30 minutes, 1 hour to 30 days. You can even edit your event triggering settings as well as your measurement settings. Now to connect to the Energy Analyze Plus software you want to use a USB-C or an Ethernet cable. Right here we have the Energy Analyzer Plus software open. Um, the Energy Analyzer Plus software is used to update the analyzer firmware, download campaign, analyze energy or load profiles. It is also capable of analyzing voltage, current harmonics, review the voltage and current events. You can also add comments, annotate pictures, etc. Overlay data from different campaigns. You can also create a report or export measurement results. Now, you wanna click download data you want to hit select all or just select one that you want to view. Then you want to click download. So here you can see all the data that we have taken previously. 
can see your um, what you had your settings on, your start and end time, uh, your events recorded, your trans transient settings, uh, recorded intervals, and then your limited your limit settings, and then as well as your K factors. Thanks for watching our video on the Fluke 1777. If you have any questions or would like to rent one, please visit us at www.atechcorp.com.